Here's your word for the day from Calvary in Lake Havasu. Visit us on the web at calvaryaz.com. Hi, I'm Christian, and I have your word for the day. Have you ever been in a difficult situation for an extended period and wondered if God would move? Today's word for the day takes a look at Psalms 105. It's a summation of the story of God's chosen people from captivity through deliverance and into the promised land. If you're unfamiliar with the story, I encourage you to read it. When we go through difficult times, it's helpful to look back and see how God fulfilled all his promises in the past. If you're currently in one of the times of waiting on the Lord, I'd like you to point you to the instructions in verse four. It says, seek the Lord and his strength, seek his presence continually. What does it mean to seek something? Seeking is defined as actively searching or pursuing. You have to be energetic and purposely engaged to actively pursue something. This is not timid, lethargic waiting. Seeking requires action. This is how we should pursue the Lord and his strength and make the same effort to be in his presence. In practical terms, let me encourage you to follow these steps. First, seek the Lord by studying his word to understand his nature. Read the Bible daily. Pray that God will reveal himself to you through the scripture. If you don't have a Bible, leave a comment, let me know, and I'll ship one to you. You can also download the free YouVersion Bible app and follow one of their numerous Bible studies. Secondly, seek his strength by holding on to his promises and having faith that he will do as he says. It's easier to believe that God will do what he says when you read the Bible and learn how he has always fulfilled his promises. It's his nature to do what he says, and seeing that he has done it repeatedly helps cement that in our hearts. And three, surround yourself in his presence. There are a few ways to accomplish this. One way is to mute out all the distractions of your day. Find quiet solitude someplace beautiful in nature where you can see his awesome creation on display. If you're like me and love music, put on praise music and worship him that way. If you're really like me and have a drum set at home, put headphones on and truly praise him with crashing cymbals. And finally, don't forget the last word of verse four, continually. We need to make a habit of seeking the Lord, his strength and his presence. By doing it continually, we will experience hope, peace and joy. Remember, God is faithful. Have a great day, Calvary.